Hey guys, welcome or welcome back. If you are new here, my name is Natasha and I am just going to be doing a cash on stuffing where I go through my transactions from the previous week and pay myself back. Um, so these little colored squares are days that I didn't spend any money. Okay, so I'm just going to go through my unbudgeted, um, just highlight them real quick. So everything else I did have money for, so I'm just going to go and highlight um pink means that i didn't have money for those days so i only had two unbudgeted days where i spent money that i did not have which means i swept my credit card and that for me is unbudgeted for me that's what unbudgeted is everyone has their different um like way that they do unbudgeted but that's just my way of doing it um i just don't want to kind of like stop myself from using money that i don't have in my envelopes so that's just how i do it so i had five days of on budget of sorry no spend days so i'm just gonna start pulling the money out um of the envelopes for each transaction so this day i paid for my gift card for my winner of my giveaway so that was 30 bucks um so that was in here in my youtube envelope so that was 30 dollars, which i put away for that uh, giveaway so we have 30 and then next was chewy which was 5361 which was in here as well in my dog envelope so I'll take out 55 and I still have 20 dollars left and I am updating my trackers so I will pull out this tracker so I can update that so it was 53.61. So I'm actually gonna use this money in here. I have some singles for a dollar savings challenge that I do. So I'm just gonna break a five. I'm actually just gonna take out all these ones. I'm probably gonna need them. And let's see. So we have one, two, three, four, five. So it was actually $54, so I just need to take out $1 and put it to the side. Apple was $3, and that is a bill. I forgot to highlight the Chewy. Um, Dunkin' Donuts, let me see if I put the money away because I thought I did, I don't know. Okay, I did, cool. So I put away $10 for Dunkin' Donuts because I spent the money, but on my credit card but i actually had it in my cash um, i just didn't cash stuff yet so i have ten dollars there so this is covered and then for contacts it was 86.52 so i'm taking that out of my sinking funds binder okay so here is my saving my sinking funds binder in medical, I don't even know. I only have sixty-five dollars left, and the contacts were eighty-five, twenty, forty, fifty, sixty-five. So, what I'm gonna do for that is put sixty-five to the side, and I'm just gonna write here in pink, like to add it, unbudgeted twenty dollars. Um, I've never had to do this before, but, um, it is what it is because I did not have the money for my contacts, um, because other things came up for me as well. So I just didn't have the money for it. So I guess technically that would be like an, a spend day because I had to use my buffer. Um, all right. Then Honda was 286.25. So we'll pull out 290 and... Okay, so that's 290. I'm gonna pull out the tracker because I do want to update that as well. I don't track all of my envelopes, but um, the ones that are, I guess, important to me, I guess I do. So it was actually 286. So I'm going to break this 20. All right, so 270, 
Is that right? No. So I need another twenty dollars actually. No, so I don't. Okay, two seventy eighty five six. Okay, so four dollars going to the dollar savings challenge. So two eighty six is going here. Alright, so we're gonna highlight that green. And then for Spirit, this Halloween store, um, I spent $30, $27.02. So I'm going to pull out $30 from here. So let's see. Okay, so we need 30 bucks. So... 20, 30. And this will go back into the Halloween envelope. And I actually am also going to break this. So it was twenty it was um twenty seven, so one, two, three, four, five. And we need twenty seven and then three dollars is going into the dollar savings challenge. I'm gonna highlight that green. Alright, and then everything else was unbudgeted, so let's count up the unbudgeted money. So this is my pile of money that's going back to the bank. Oh, wait, I didn't highlight this one green. I'm going to do first the unbudgeted. So uh, we had Duncan for 14. Oops. For 14, 60. And then also McDonald's for 14, 02. And then $20. So 48, 62. All right, so now I'm going to add up all the green ones, and then I'm going to add um, 80, 65 for that one, for the contacts. So I'll do that one first. So that was 65 for that. 30 for Amazon. Chewy was 54. Duncan was 10. Honda was 286. Spirit was 27. So I should have $472 here. So we have 100, 200, 20, 40, 60, 80, 300, 20, 40, 50, 400, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 65, 6, 7, 8, 9, 70, 1, 2. So that's good, 472. All right. So cash was 472. And then I'm gonna write I paid. So it was 48 plus 472 plus 48. So 520. That's how much I spent for this week. So um, I am going to put this money back into the bank and make a payment. Um, the money comes out of my buffer. So let me just show you guys that. Um, so my buffer is for my child support money. So basically, I'm going to write here, Chase, um, $50. I'm just going to round it up. So I'm going to write Chase, $50. All right, so I had $195 in the buffer to start with um, after I paid my bills with the money I had. That's how much it was, and that's how much I had left over. So my Chase... Um, I'm paying to chase $50 from this account, $195, and that is it, guys, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.